In this Office 365 tip, we'll be looking at inserting pictures in your Word document. I know Word already gives me a headache. I've never been great at using Word, but it does help uh, getting to learn how to do some of these things to uh, lessen your frustration. So if I had to go and select an image to insert into this um, Word document, and I uh, will just insert that image, um, you'll have different options. So sometimes you want the image to be wrapped by other images. So if I drag this image slightly smaller, maybe you actually want this image to be wrapped by images, uh, by text, or maybe you even want it to be behind um, um, the text. So if you click on the image, you'll see that there's a little button on the right hand side and it's uh, called layout options. Now in layout options, I can actually um, wrap. So you'll see that it's got square wrap, it's got tight wrap, um, through wrap, um, then top and bottom, behind text and in front of text. So if I had to take square wrap, you'll see that um, I can then actually move this around and it'll put text around it. If I use the tight wrap, which I normally prefer, it actually comes out a little bit neater as, a, as it just wraps a little bit closer to the image. Of course, I can also use behind the image. So this works great for um, watermark type um, images where you actually want to bring bigger, more bold text over it and then um, have the rest of the text different. Of course, that all depends on the image, of course, that you'll be using. So putting it behind the text and then, of course, um, you can also put it in front of text, which let's just think about that really doesn't uh, make a lot of sense for me. So I definitely wouldn't use that to put it in front of text. So the one that I use most uh, often would definitely be the tight wrap, which actually just brings it in nice and neat. And um, it'll actually wrap the text very nicely um, around the image for you to be able to use or even to, uh, to use the images on the side. So I think that'll help you a bit. So um, layout options in, um, in Word for the images will definitely help you create better looking documents.